I actually had a dream where the border people <sighs> the customs border people the government of Canada were tracking me using my phone and I left for a walk police came after me and I was fined and taken to jail um so I'm I'm gonna stay home for a while now. Yeah, happy day three. Good morning. It's day two. It's also raining outside and I kind of love it. It's like peaceful, it's soothing, it's dark and gloomy. I'm all cozy in my how do I show you my outfit? in my super cozy outfit. Um, listen to some good chill, like jazzy tunes. That's what I'm feeling today. Oh my God, those seagulls. Hmm. I also wanted to make an effort to change my outfit every day. It gives me something to do when I wake up. It gives me a nice little challenge and like not be in sweatpants every single day for the next 14 days. So this is my outfit for today. Midday snack, always a genuine health vegan protein bar. Oh, so good. Watching uh, Little Fires Everywhere still. Have I mentioned that yet? I'm watching Little Fires Everywhere. Excellent, excellent. Day three has been relatively chill. Self-care today looks like combing through my finances and making sure everything's in order and organizing everything from last month into my Excel sheet. To kind of track everything and that's what I'm doing while I watch Little Fires Everywhere. Episode eight, woo! So satisfying to look at your spreadsheet, have all the numbers add up, color code it. I kind of like doing my finances, makes me feel adulty and productive, but it's also fun. Anyways, done that, feeling great. Also finished Little Fires Everywhere, I mentioned that. I just finished Little Fires Everywhere and I can't believe it. I can't, I can't believe it. Now what am I gonna do? And so I'm feeling very good today. Today's a great day. It's okay, we've got two other shows on the go. We've got Afterlife and Indian Matchmakers. So good, so good. It's actually day four today, not day five. And speaking of day four, we are four days into quarantine and I've already finished two of the three shows that we were watching, so I'm gonna need more because I've got 10 more days to go. Interesting, so there's some special questions today. Let's go, we're gonna miss the sunset. Oh, 
most exciting part of my day. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. It's day nine, and I think it's starting to get to me a little bit. Um, I'm starting to get a little antsy. It's tough, this is tough. Guys, today is my last day in quarantine. I actually can't believe it. I feel like it went pretty fast. I've actually quite enjoyed my 14 days in quarantine. I think it's important to kind of slow down, spend some time with yourself and your thoughts. I'm actually really curious to know how my life is going to change now that I'm not in quarantine. Now that I have the choice to leave, will I leave? I'm free! <sighs> I'm free! I'm out of quarantine! But I'm still inside. I don't know what to do. I'm so overwhelmed. Oh, there's so many possibilities. Where do I go? I should have thought about this before. But I'm free. All right. Let's get moving. Alright, we're gonna do a Q&A. And there's a video, kind of test. It's the lighting here. I can't stop touching my hair. I just straightened it. Okay, we're finally going to do a Q&A. I honestly don't know how long I can do this YouTube life. It takes up so much time and energy and space on my computer and my phone. I'm really not a uh, technologically savvy YouTuber. There you go, that way. What way? Which way? Can you hear that? Oh, this way? Yeah. I don't think the lighting's as good. 